welcome back to Griffin, Indiana with me, PS2 Gamer, on Farming Simulator 22. So, where we left off is where we're picking up. Um, we're just finishing off the stone picking here. And over in the corner, we're going to start um, putting down some... Should we do corn? Now, this is the question. I think we should do sunflowers purely because we will then be able to turn it into oil. Um, that will give us something to, to produce. So I think we're going to go with sunflowers. Um, I think that's what I said in the last video as well. I, I just cannot remember for the life of me. Um, okay, let's turn on the cedar. And let's get started. Are you going to do anything? Come on. Lower it. There we go, guys. One of these days. One of these days. <laughs> so between my uh, Survival 7 and this, it's just trying to remember what I did for each one now. Um, but... I'm loving the progress of this farm. I'm really enjoying it. We have 28,000 in the um, in the bank, and yeah, let's let's go make some more money. So I'm thinking there is a harvesting contract here. Um, so that needs to get to Mount Illinois. That's always a little bit frustrating because I can't keep the rest of it. Um, but money's money, so let's borrow the items and get that done. I'm going to leave these two here to finish this off. It shouldn't take them too long. Um, contract number 10, that's a nice small field actually, so that is fantastic news. And they've given me my favourite Kubotas, which I'm very grateful for. Right, let's get somebody driving this over. If we put the vehicle just about there, that will be perfect. And because we have no traffic, I think I'm just going to drive with this on the back, on the front, and not worry too much. Am I not getting this right? Come on. There we go. Yeah, we'll be fine with this on the front. It's only round the corner. It's almost tempting to call for the, uh, <laughs> the train now. It might just come in time. Uh, so I have checked up on the BGA. We've still got about two and a half thousand litres of manure in the back of the truck. Um, that's going to need to stay in there until the bunker makes more space. So the bunker is our Achilles heel at the moment. The only alternative is to get another bunker. I think that was what, 57,000? And we've still got a loan that we've only paid 10 grand off. So I'm very conscious of, of trying to get rid of the loan, trying to keep a sustainable income. It's all rather crazy. We don't have traffic on, so I'm just going to keep driving. What route did he go? <laughs> crazy. significantly faster than me that's for sure but whilst we are driving I'm gonna start unfolding this harvester let's get it all ready and prepared <laughs>
so we've done a few passes already I, should, I think we're about 50% done I would say so uh, you would have seen in that video as well I just went to have a quick check the stone picking is completed the um, the planting of the sunflowers is going very very well and also I just pop, topped up the BGA as well just to get that underway keep that bunker churning we've got about 1,000 was it 1,700 left so yeah we just got to keep on just got to keep on going with that until it takes everything um, I'm hoping it does before we skip into Mar um, sorry May <laughs> going backwards in time am I um, I am going to let a worker jump in here and we're going to go and take this yeah, I guessed it was close, but 93%, that's great. So we're going to take this over to the train station, ready for loading up onto the train. So I apologise if you can hear in the background uh, our washing machine. Our, uh, our little Roxy has finally come on to her first season, bless her. Um, and uh, if you haven't seen dog in pants <clears throat> it is very funny i'll post a i'll put a picture on here if i if i remember during editing i'll put a picture of her um in her pants um and uh, yeah we just just washing a load so i apologize if you can hear that in the background on the plus side she's extremely extremely cuddly um, that's one of the benefits of them being in season. Roxy seems to have gone the cuddly route rather than the aggressive runaway scary route, which I know some some people experience that with with their pups. Um, but yeah, she's a big girl now, aren't you, girl? So uh, it's very cute. Luna is really sort of she must sense that Roxy's going through something she's really backed off of the playing they're not she's given her lots of space it's really good she's been a fantastic sister right let's pull this in So it's um, coming up to 10 past 6, no, it's just gone 10 past 6 now, um, let's get that down before I drive out, uh, 10 past 6 in the evening, we've still got some daylight, so we're going to keep on going. Hopefully we can get this <clears throat> all done this month. That'd be really good. Let, while we're here, let's just drive in. Pop. That's here. That was strange timing. The train's just coming. That means it's going to take forever to come when we call it later. Ah! Always happens! Always happens! Okay, so let's check on the progress of these. 33, 35... 30... Oh, we had a 41 there. Okay, yeah, so it's 1,753. So we've just got to keep on pulling that in. Let's find out how much methane we have. 17,446. I am desperate to get that to a point where we can sell it. So once that's all processed through, obviously we've got the slurry off at the moment. We're only doing the manure. So it's still, the bunker's still got 14,985 to push into the fermenter and we've still got that 1400 left let's have a look here okay that's processing as quickly as it, it, it receives it so interesting we just have to wait there's nothing more we can do than wait right now 
Um, in fact, we can turn these off whilst that's not processing. Otherwise, we're just paying for it for no reason. Okay, well, let's keep coming back to this. I'm excited to see if our experiment comes, brings us a nice healthy bank balance. I'm very confident that we are going to turn a profit on that money. I mean, that amount of methane, that's going to sell for more than 1,000, was it 1,300? I should have written this down somewhere. So if that is the case, we can just buy that manure and it, well, we'll use our manure, of course, we'll use our manure first and foremost, but anything else we can top it up with purchased manure and keep that bunker topped up. So I can keep the bunker topped up with the um, silage. I went a bit crazy on the old silage, didn't I? So I've got plenty of silage. <laughs> plenty of silage. Um, and then I, I suppose we can buy slurry as well if we wanted to, to keep that again topped up. Just whilst we are not producing enough ourselves, we at least should be trying to make as much profit as possible. Um, there we go. So we've now just caught up with the harvester. Let's pull this in just behind him. And with the tank at 80%, let's just empty this now. What do we think? Another trailer load in a bit? Probably. Whilst we're here, let's see if there's any more contracts. No, no more contracts, that's fine. Okay, I think I'm going to put this harvester. Let's go in here. So then the that's always on the outside. Although these go up and down, don't they, the workers, rather than round and round like I do. So how is everybody? Everyone having a nice week? I think by the time this posts, it will be the weekend. So I hope you have a nice weekend. I'm only a few episodes ahead at the moment been busy with work since um, being back and I have been playing uh, SnowRunner offline as well uh, I only purchased it a few days ago I've never it's been another game which I've never played so I thought oh, I'll pick that up and give it a go because they've just brought out that uh, DLC for the harvest and that looked really interesting but I'm just working my way through very 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 painfully slowly the contracts <clears throat> it's actually much harder than it looks much 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 harder um, and I'm sure the people which drive those trucks in real life said yes yeah, see it's not easy um, so I've I believe the first map is Michigan so I've been driving in Michigan it's mainly very muddy boggy ground um, and the town's going through lots of different repairs and I'm delivering things to different locations um, and then the next so I then thought oh you know snow runner I want to try Alaska of course I want to try Alaska so I went there and I thought, okay, I'm really unprepared for this. So um, I managed to complete one mission in Alaska 
and I thought, okay, I'm going to go back to the Michigan map and just practice, get used to it. A lot of that game, it it seems that you need to build your money and contracts up so that you can get enough equipment and upgrades to be able to afford to do these much more difficult runs. So you kind of have to put in quite a lot of time investment into the game, which, you know me, I, I'm, I put in months in this game before I even decided to start recording, just to make sure I knew what I was doing. Um, so I, I think I, I'm going to persevere with it off camera and see if I can get in a position where I'm quite, A, a enjoying it, because at the moment it makes me quite anxious actually, like the, just getting stuck all the time. Um, but you winch your way out and the graphics are phenomenal. I'm so impressed. Um, I'm just going to empty this out. And the uh, the controls and the the, the the reality of the situation. Um, how they how they've done it, I do not know. It's so impressive. But there's all kinds of scenarios on there, so I think it would be fun to eventually uh, record myself playing it. But I'm a th I think I'm a quite a few months off of that because my main priority is is playing farm sim. I just love it. I I, I record this because I genuinely love the game. Um, and I didn't play it yesterday, and I really missed it. So I think that says a lot when you just love what you're doing. Um, it, it, it doesn't, it, 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 yeah, and you miss it. That's, that's the most important thing, right? Okay, so let's now go and top this up. I know I keep topping it up every few, like half an hour or so. Just got to get it to that point. Um, and now this is done and ready, which I'm very happy about. So this needs lime and rolling, so we're going to get involved with that. Um, and I think I am going to put in here... Oh, should I put sunflower as well? Everybody scream, scream at the... It's a shame I'm not playing this live so people can vote. Um... Okay, I'll do corn. I'll do corn on this one. Decision made. Okay, <clears throat> let's go empty the stone picker. So I just quickly jump out here. We're going to need to come and move some of this. Because that's not going to spawn anywhere. All right, I need to think about doing that as well. How's this one? No, this one's fine. Okay. <clears throat> Sorry, I've got a bit of a frog in my throat today. So we'll get these lined, then rolled. We need to do that before the clock ticks over to May, that's the important thing. Now did I send back the, uh, the spreader? Let me just have a look whilst that's doing that. I don't own one. I did, so I'm going to need to run down to the shop and pick one up. Okay, that's fine. Let me just think out loud. That's this one we usually use, isn't it? Okay, let's leash you. Okay, excellent. Let's drop. We don't need the stone picker anymore, so we'll get rid of that. We'll return you. Yes, thank you. Okay. 
so I will run down to the shop. We're also going to need a roller, aren't we? I wonder if I could be cheeky and attach a roller to the front and the spreader at the back. Well, let's find out, shall we? I'll see you in a bit. So the grain got full, grain tank, so I just come to grab this load as well. Uh, my lime, I couldn't take the roller at the same time, it was impossible. Um, so I've sent a worker to take the uh, spreader up to the top field and then I will come and grab it to get the roller afterwards. So I'm just going to get this all delivered and I will see you back up at the farm shortly. Right, that's all dropped off. Um, we're starting to lose this daylight now, so I'm on a little bit of a let's get this done fast mode. I do like working under pressure though, so if it's a time pressure I'm good with that. I think I might just stop off hiring this and just keep it on the farm um, and just take the daily lease cost. By the time I come round to paying for it again and the time wasted going to pick it up etc, I think it's just going to be worth me just keep it here, just keep it on the farm. So I've topped it up completely with lime, not too expensive at the moment, which was very handy. And of course we have that 25% off purchase point on our farm. So I just popped up saying an AI worker has finished its task. When I dropped off the corn at the silo, I asked for a driver to bring it back. So that's great. That means that's there with the New Holland. We need that contract done. These two farm, these two fields lined and rolled before we click into the next month. That's going to be a little bit of a tall order, I think. But let's try, shall we? I'm just going to set a worker on this so I can have a look up here. Okay, this is nearly done. Oh, this is positive. Okay, let's pull this all the way down to the end. Excellent. Okay, okay. This is good. Right, while we're here, let's pour some more of this in. I do keep coming back here and pouring more in. This is over halfway through. But we need this to be done urgently so that we can lime and roll. This liming is... I've left a worker to do it and... Yeah, it's a gap, but that's because of my driving, not his. Um, let's take back over. Let's get down, do this pass very quickly. Okay, so that's probably the new Holland finish there. AI worker B, I think that is the New Holland. I'm going to have a little bit of a clash now with this, aren't I? If I just move this way, I should still be able to spray. Yeah, brilliant. 
I'm just going to spray this little bit that I missed. Should have just turned the spray off then. There we go. Wasting lime. Naughty, naughty. Okay, let's get this last little pass done. And what I will, I think my plan is, oh, there's the washing machine finishing. You will definitely hear that in the background. <laughs> what I think I will do is send a driver to pick up the roller. I will um, go and deliver the rest of the corn, call for the train. Let's get this over here ready for when we need it. Okay, fantastic. Let's drop that. Okay, let's get this down to the shops. Can you get that? Yeah, okay, great. Oh, I nearly had it. Nearly, nearly, nearly. There we go. Right, let's get in the jump in the New Holland. Offload this 7,000 litres. It's all very exciting at this point. We're chasing the daylight. <laughs> okay first things first let's call for the train then deliver the corn oh it's only 1.9 kilometers away fantastic right let's let's get this back up at the Point where we need it. AI worker G, that means the worker is pulled up ready to collect the roller. Whoopsie, sorry everyone. Yep, there's that tractor. Let's just sort this out first. Get this back up at the farm. course for this guy. In fact, let's create a job. Let's do field work and get him starting straight away. There we go. The train is already there. Let's deliver this. Oh, come on, 460 litres. Right. Oh, I went past. It's, I'm just switching the carriages. Open the cover. Zoom in, it's quite hard to see in the dark. Excellent. Let's start filling up with the corn. Oh, 
hopefully by the time we finish this the roller should be up and at least started let's go add a great bit of variety to the game doesn't it being able to jump from the train I do find it remarkably relaxing and there we go yes we do Thank you very much. Contract completed. So let's collect that. And then let's hop over here. Okay, so this is nearly done. He is nearly up at the location. I'm going to take over because I'll be faster at driving. Okay, we're creeping up to 8 p.m. leave him to do that this is nearly done let's have a quick look over here incredibly infuriating if we can't get this all in before the end of the month but this is what I'm impressed with And it's nice that the John Deere is getting a chance to do some good work. Nice is, this is all getting fertilised at the same point. So as soon as the John Deere is done, we'll detach the cedar, sorry, the planter in the additional um, tank. We'll get the lime work done. Then hopefully by that point, the roller will be ready to come over here. question we did it we did everything we set out to do today I'm very happy with that well thank you ever so much everybody for joining me for another episode I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did and of course if you did please like and if you haven't done so already please hit that subscribe button and most of all thank you so much for watching I really do appreciate you take care now Bye.